hello dears welcome back to the channel Benny by Anna it's me Anna with you here and today we are in the British Street area I'm bringing you a new video about which hotels will be opening or closing down for winter we will see hotels such as Flash Riviera Beach Hotel and of course the lovely and brand new Ambassador. Stay with me, let's so go. So the first one of course will be the Ambassador Playa. This is right now the four stars hotel one before it was the three one. They made it brand new almost from scratch. It's amazing how it looks like from the outside and I'm sure that on the inside it's even more beautiful. We will see if maybe we will be lucky and soon we'll be able to check this hotel from the inside. Of course, it will be open up this winter. This is one of the few ones that will be opening up for all winter season right now, January, February and so on the entire year long because it was closed for such a long time that right now a lot of people want to visit it especially taking into consideration the spectacular changes they did to this hotel. I'll put you the approximate price here on the screen. I've checked it online and the lowest price that I have found for winter days for January, for example, I'll just put it for you here on the screen. The next hotel we will be checking is Sol Melia Pelicanos Ocas. As I've said, it's one of the Melia Hotels chain. This is one of the few hotels that have very strict protocol and unfortunately they don't allow filming inside. As for now, maybe things will change and in the future I'll do some video with them. Who knows? You never know what the future might bring you. But at least for now, uh, it's not possible. Even so, we are heading there to show you how the hotel looks like, if there's a lot of people on the entrance, if not, and basically what's going on in there. While we're heading down to the hotel, just want to show you that there are quite a few people here still in this area. Most of the hotels in here are related with the British tourism. Um, and mostly this is the type of international tourism in general that is coming in here. Very, very few Spanish and national tourists are coming. I thought none of these hotels will be closing just because international tourism is still there. I know UK is going like to plan B starting from this Friday, if I'm not wrong, correct me if I'm wrong, um, because that's just some of the information that I was getting. So I thought things won't change, but with the new restrictions coming up, there might be some changes and probably this is why three of the six hotels will be checking on today. So exactly 50% of them will be closing for winter for shorter or longer amount of time, depends on every hotel. So basically this is Sol. This is Sol Ocas, that building right there. And this is Sol Pelicanos. Basically these are the two buildings of the Melia group. They are still open, by the way, they're not planning on closing just because this is a very, very popular place for international tourism to come. They have quite affordable prices, I must say. And uh, I've checked the price for December, like one night in December. Of course, not on Christmas Day or Christmas Eve, okay, but uh, still like in other, any other day of December. The price is just of 64 euros to come here to Sol by Melia. 64 euros a night and in January there is one specific offer that they have to come to these like these buildings this hotel there's a price of 48 euros but that's directly on their website and it might be over soon but at least for now this is the offer 48 euros for just one night of stay in here I mean that's a very very good price considering that it's winter time already and there is not a lot of people coming right now to hotels in general they've seen a huge drop not only like this hotel in general all of them for example the dynastic hotel which is the one that we uh, my husband works in they used to have like 300 200 and right now it's basically 80 90 people at once which is very very few 
it's basically nothing, but it's still better than closing down the hotel. Dynastic, by the way, is not thinking of closing. Never, ever, ever. They were open during pandemics and they'll be open right now. No changes in there. Here there are still some tourists, people coming in, going out. So there's still life in these hotels. The next one that I want to show you is a Flash Hotel, which is a four stars. We've been inside of this hotel. This was one of the first few that I've started to show you here on the channel. Uh, thank you for the management once again. I'm not sure if they'll be watching the videos. If they will, thank you a lot for being able to show it because I know a lot of people were waiting for this video. And this is the Flash Hotel right here four stars as you know if you want to see the video of any of these hotels because a lot of them i was filming i'll put you a link here on the screen on the top but just in case if you go to my playlist and you choose hotels you'll be able to see all the hotels that i was filming here in benny dome just in case one of them will be your next choice for your upcoming visit flash hotel very very sad but they will be closing down very soon on the 3rd of january it's not going to be a long closure slightly more than a month on the 11th of february they will be opening up back again with usual work schedule normality as usual but at least for one month and a few days they will be closing down just because these dates tend to be when you have way way less tourism and it's a huge hotel that you need to maintain has a lot of different areas to offer and just um, for the low amount of people that will be coming as they think it just does not make any sense but as for now it's open the music is on and there are a lot of christmas lights and nice decoration on the inside here i just had to take the sound out due to music copyright because the music is very very loud on these lovely terraces here on the sunshine but you can just see how the hotel is lovely decorated with a christmas tree on the inside for the upcoming holidays the next hotel we will be checking is right here nearby the flash hotel it's the lovely server group hotel calypso we've been to that one as well we filmed it not so long ago uh, at the end of summer if i'm not wrong you can also see this video in my playlist of hotels of benidorm and this hotel is right here it's open right now but it will be closing up in january Servi group uh, calypso hotel as you know it's the three-star superior hotel of a big chain of Servi groups so they have several hotels here in benidorm a lot of them were oriented towards the international or british tourism and this hotel as i've said will be open up until 9th of january then it's going to be closing down and will open up for the new 2022 spring summer season on the 11th of march as for now they have everything decorated nicely for christmas for the fiestas which is very very nice to see terrace is open a lot of things everything is fully functioning and there are quite a few guests already here in the hotel although not as much as in summer but still there are tourists in here which is very very nice to see heading down to the next one here in the row all these hotels are situated basically on the same same street right here that's nice that's a nice christmas tree next one on the list our lovely rosamar hotel we've seen it already here on the channel i'll put your link down below this is one of the hotels that has been changed from scratch approximately the same as the ambassador playa hotel did and it's just very very nice to see the changes that these hotels are making it's this beauty right here behind me as you can see it's closed there are some cars but it's just because they are of the workers of this hotel this is the same chain as the hotel flash so i called them i asked what's going to be going on if the hotel will be open or closed and what they said basically and it surprised me that rosamar is closed starting from now and it will 
keeping closed up until the 1st of June 2022. So basically, more than six months, it will be closed. I'm not sure of why, because it it's just beautiful on the inside. You've seen it on the videos. The hotel is amazing. They've changed a lot of things in there. Maybe they need to do some more changes or maybe they just prefer to leave only the Flash Hotel open just in case before the tourism will fully recover. Who knows? But the main news is that it's going to be closed sadly up until the 1st of June. A true shame because the hotel itself was looking amazing and all the rooms, all the changes that they have did were worth it. But up until the 1st of June, we will not be able to see it working again. Right near to Rosamar Hotel, there is the Riviera Beach Hotel, four stars, very, very nice. We did not film that one just yet. I wish to film it so, so much. I've been in contact with the management, but we will see what will be going on. Maybe we are lucky and we will be able to see this beauty from the inside. I'm sure I'll be loving the colors that they have because they have a lot of greens, very, very nice, colorful hotel. So maybe we'll be able to see it very, very soon. Riviera Beach Hotel will be open. It will continue to be open no matter what, as for now at least and the prices are as follows you can see them here on the screen at least like the minimum price that i found on the website different websites including booking.com and etc you can see the prices that they have as for the day of today and for christmas and in general winter time here in benidorm have seen and as I've mentioned at the beginning of the video three of the six hotels we've seen today will be closing down for winter it's something that is very very common in here but maybe slightly more right now when we start getting back some more restrictions in a lot of countries in the world let's just hope that for when they will be opening back again everything will be back to normal and people will be able to travel and enjoy these amazing hotels thank you all for watching i hope you enjoyed today watching today's video and i'll see you very very soon with a new video from our lovely benidorm area bye everyone